on EA Sports. A perfect 70 degree day as we get set for today's matchup. I don't know which team has the better tight end, but I do know that that could very well be the difference in this game today. Well, if you made me choose between the two, I'll tell you what. I'll just say you take one. I don't care who you take. I'll take the other because they're both that good. And finally, the defense steps up. Yeah, the defense stepped up, but also, boy, that was a uninspired play call, I thought, on third down. Didn't give the offense a chance, and the defense took advantage of it. way quarters formation here for the defense intercepted he's brought down that was an awesome job by the defense they just and that's going to bring us to fourth down Jim when you get in these situations there's not much you can do third long not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations He'll take the snap from the gun. That's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it and see what they do on this third down situation. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Out of the shotgun formation. Looks to his left. Has to extend for that one. And he's got it. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work. And they stop the offense that time. The offense is still on the field right now. Fourth down, and they'll need to pick up two. Let's go! Go for the end! Three, three. The first down yardage. Good job by the offense getting the first down in the red zone. Now it becomes tricky. Can you deceive the defense where you get a chance to get a score? They're able to move the chains after that last run. Quarters formation here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Incomplete looking underneath that time. Second down coming up. Quarters formation here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. He's looking to the right, throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. Well, when you get close to the goal line, you always have to look out for the tight end because anytime there's a, just a little bit of deception, that deception is enough for the tight end to get that area where he can get open that time he does it touchdown Mason Crosby ready for the kickoff Tate will test the coverage and they stop him from running it out to the 20 mark him down at the 19 this is set at the line for the first down after that completion quarters formation here for the defense Dropping back now into the shotgun. Reaches out and snatches it. D'Angelo Hall in on the stop. Boy, they got a good drive going here, Jim. I guess you don't hear that too much on the golf course, do you? The way you hit it everywhere. But this offense, they're clicking. They're making plays. Let's see if they can take advantage of uh, just moving this football down the field. First down here after the completion. We'll go no huddle. And the 
give to Frank Gore. And Geekly in on the tackle. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Second and goal at the one. And Broncos in the end zone. Well, here we are. It's a tie game now. We'll see how the teams react to it. Will it be positive or negative? He made it. The Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. The Chiefs have it at the 44. Rob Gronkowski with the grab. The Chiefs believe they can pick up the first in this short yardage situation and keep the offense on the field. Lynch up the middle. The Chiefs get a first down. The Chiefs decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. First down here after the run. Johnson is in the backfield. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. From the gun. Heaving it down the field. Oh, and almost picked off that time. The defense did everything right in that situation. They were in the right slot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes. But they dropped the pass. And now they'll try over again on second down. Quarters formation here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Snapping out of the gun. Makes the reception. And he's tackled. He'll be a yard short of the first. The offense stops the clock right away with a timeout. 52-yard field goal attempt coming up. The field goal attempt is good it's good many more possibilities what you can do on the offensive side good job by the offense first down at the 21 incomplete almost going in the other direction well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted, and the guy dropped it, and you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? Second down coming up. Three, three. Moreno lined Let's up go. in the backfield. They go draw. It's Moreno up the middle. Game's about three. The Broncos have the football as the fourth quarter gets started. This is third down. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. Play clock's running down. Gets it out for the completion. Good yardage picked up on that call. Good play call that time by the offensive coordinator. Down inside when you're inside that 20-yard line or the red zone, find ways to complete the pass. They did that time. First and goal from the three. Oh, touchdown, Denver. Good job that time by the offense, scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead. And when you get ahead in a football game, the National Football League, it makes you relax and you play better. Sebastian Janikowski lining up for the kickoff. Signaling for fair catch. His team still has a chance. He must produce something in a hurry. Has Andre Johnson. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second Number half, eight. they're losing a close game. And you get that first down, it just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook. And it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. Looking long. It's intercepted. Tackles made. Remaining in the game. It's 
first down as they head to the line. They load it up now, bring out the jumbo formation. They send the tight end in motion. Out of the eye, it's Gore. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. And here we have second down. The jumbo set on the field. Tight end in motion. Second and 12. Four. And picks up maybe three or four. The Chiefs will stop the clock here with this timeout, needing to preserve time. After that run, third and eight for the offense. Let's go. Third and eight throws the pass. He makes the catch. That's a gain of eight. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line, but sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion line. Crucial play here. Fourth down on the way. They'll go, go with the extra Two, tonnage five. here with the jumbo Two, set. Three. Three, three. The Broncos use another timeout. And he muffs it. The ball's on the ground. They needed the ball back, and they got it off the punt. And now they need points, and they do have timeouts to work with here in the final two minutes. Yeah, having those timeouts is everything. What do we always say? Use those timeouts in the first half. In the second half, protect them like they're gold. Give this offense and the coach credit. They saved the He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. Wide open for the catch. They return to the red zone with them in sweet or are the close ones that much more satisfying than just blowing someone out for 60 minutes? Well, the close ones.